Hey guys, it's Vino, and I've got some explaining to do, don't I? I've got three questions, and I'm gonna answer them in quick fire succession, and hopefully this will like solve ev or answer everything you guys have been maybe wondering. Number one, where have I been? I've been pretty lazy right now. I've actually, I, I've been kind of busy with uni work. Uh, mostly, it's, I've been kind of lazy though. I've had plenty of time to make videos, uh, but I've kind of just been playing like a lot of games in my free time. Uh, I think it's mostly because I've be, I've had like, when I was working on the Stripe LP, I had a, a lot of like video problems. Like I think I had things going out of sync. I had audio cutting out. Here's an example. Calling Morel or else sleaze is paying him a compliment. And uh, I think just it took me a lot of time. And by the point where I kind of started giving up, I had a lot of assignments that I started getting and I needed to work on a lot. And uh, that basically ate my time and I pretty much just kind of played games to cool off as opposed to like, okay, I've done working on my assignment. Now I'm gonna work on some videos. So yeah, I, yeah, I didn't really want to work on videos while doing that. Um, so it's mostly because of that. I also tried experimenting a bit with Adobe Premiere because uh, doing animations in Vegas is not the easiest thing in the world, but I feel it was very tricky and I, again, I didn't really have much patience uh, working with it right now. So at least right now we're still stuck to, well, we're still using Sony Vegas, so yeah. Number two, what's gonna happen to the Strife Let's Play? Uh, yeah, you may notice that th there's been a Strife video for three months and absolutely no follow-up. I'm gonna restart the Strife Let's Play. I mean, okay, so that first video is gonna be unlisted and you can click the screen right now, you can click the annotation to view it if you really want to. It's not bad, it's just that I want to change the format a bit, so uh, what I originally wanted to do was have it so it was like a choose your own adventure, because that's what the game is. It's basically like, yeah, you get to do all these dialogue options, you get to make your own choices. The problem is, it makes, it's kind of painful in terms of making the actual, like, let's play video, because not only did I have to basically make new saves and split up every single time I came up to a choice, but also I had to make the commentary seem like unique for each one, while also I, I had to repeat this time. I had to play the same section over again and basically have a repeat commentary because a lot of the time things, uh, I, I would play the same section, but I'd have to do it in kind of two different ways. And the way I structured it basically made it so, yeah, I had to come up with new commentary every, each time. Uh, this kind of reminds me of my Sonic Adventure 2 Let's Play, except a bit of the opposite, where in that one I had to play through bits twice, like cutscenes, but I only had to commentate over one of them, and I basically choose like the best parts from each one. That's what I ended up doing. Uh, for this though, it's a bit painful because sometimes, because well, like for the Sonic Adventure one, I would have a lot of trouble like thinking up things the the second time. So a lot of the time, I just use like my first take on that. For this, it was a bit painful, and also it's a lot of work, like including the annotations, including editing the stuff, and uh, I, yeah, it's not worth it. I think overall, because the way I watch Let's Play videos is I just sit down and I, I mostly put it on idle. I, I don't watch the footage sometimes. I just listen to the commentary because I love the commentary. The thing is, is that, yeah, the way I was doing the Strife Let's Play. If you did watch every single bit of it, you'd hear the repeat commentary and you wouldn't, yeah. I didn't, I wouldn't think it's a great thing, so I just ended up, I'm just gonna ditch it. Um, I'm gonna start from scratch, uh, and it's, it's just gonna be a bit more of a traditional let's play. It's gonna be a lot quicker coming out with new videos, and uh, yeah. Now, in Strife, there is a big, like, split moment somewhere later in the game. And I will be showcasing both paths of that, because that is a big split. But for general things, like early on there's a there's a part where you can do a mission in two different ways. And I'm basically just going to be showing it the one way, because you, you get the gist of most of the content. Plus it gives you a little bit of stuff, if you do want to play the game yourself, you get to see a bit of cool stuff, so yeah. Number three, what's going to happen next after that? Uh, Definitely, I'm going to be releasing a lot of videos because I've finished uni, I've got like one more exam coming up, uh, but I've got plenty of time, uh, so yeah. I do have uh, quite a few games I have in mind that I would like to be playing, and they're going to be shorter, they're going to be easy, they're going to be simple, it's going to be some content at least, which is good. I've also got a really good RPG in mind, uh, I'm not going to say what it is, 
Although, although people who know me, they know, they know what it is. Um, it's definitely a long game though. I'm not gonna do it like pretty soon, especially because I've only done one Let's Play since Final Fantasy VII and Pokemon Blue, and those stuff took me a whole year. And I'd rather not, I'd rather not start a new Let's Play yet. So right now, I think we're just gonna stick with um, doing some shorter games. But there's definitely gonna be a lot of content. There's going to be, I'm going to be making videos. And maybe I'll be doing another analytical video, who knows? I've been a bit polarized on stuff going on in game news and media and whatever, so I'm, I will probably put that a lot in the Strife Let's Play and things I'm talking about, uh, but we'll see, we'll see. Uh, especially because the last one I did was the Payday video and oh boy, have matters changed, but that, that's enough of that, so. Oh, and just before I go, uh, I got a capture card finally working and it works great. I'm also just about to get, uh, in a few days, an AV to HDMI converter, which will allow me to play, like, old PlayStation 2, GameCube, whatever games on it. Which will be great, because, uh, that means I can record buttloads of stuff without having to resort to emulators and slightly shoddy performance on that. Uh, and that's, that will also be great, because, because then I can play any retro game I want on this channel. Yeah, provided I own it, but we'll, we'll get to that. Anyway, I'll see you kids later.